Hey guys, it's Robert with RV Weekends, and I'm here to cook something I've never cooked before. Let's get it started. All right, well, let's get to cooking. Now, when I said I've never cooked it before, what I mean is I never made a video on how I cooked it. I cooked some the other day and it came out really good. And what is it? It's flounder. Man, I can't wait to show you the meal that I'm about to cook. It's super simple. So let's get started. All right, this is what I'm gonna start with. I got my flounder filet, very thin. Flounder is very thin, as you probably know. They're very flat fish. Stay on the bottom. And uh, it's an individually wrapped filet of flounder. I got a special buy one, get one free. So that's always fun, right? And I'm going to use this Caribbean rice from Zatarans. Yeah, it's good. I'm going to use that. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to add some pineapple later. I'll show you. Now I'm going to make some veggies with that. Some California blend from Publix, uh, our local grocery. California blend with broccoli, cauliflower, cauliflower and carrots. And I'm going to add a few of my own peppers, onions, yeah, and put some garlic in there. It's going to be great. And I'm going to use some of my pre-made uh, breadcrumbs. I already made a batch up earlier and used them the other day. So I'm going to use some of this. All right. It's always important to coordinate uh, cooking time so you can get everything to come out at the same time so it's really nice and fresh and hot. So the thing that's going to take the longest is the Zatarain's rice. So let me get started on that right away. Well, it says to mix two cups of water with the rice mix and a tablespoon of butter. Bring to a boil, reduce heat, and simmer for 25 minutes. Let's get it going. All right, I'm gonna use my Disney Pass Holders cutting board I got as a gift for being an annual pass holder and I'm gonna cut the butter to one tablespoon Isn't that nice how they give you the little increments there we go we're gonna add this to the water oh and what is that chunk that's a frozen slice of pineapple so I'm gonna cut this up I'm gonna let it thaw a little bit and we're gonna cut this up and put it in the rice also And here goes the rice mix. So we're gonna get this boiling and then lower the heat. Next, I'll add the water to the veggie pot and get that boiling. I don't wanna start this yet because this won't take very long to heat up and it's only gonna take nine minutes for the veggies to boil. So this overall will probably take about 12 minutes. So I'm gonna wait till this gets boiling, start the timer, and then when this gets about 20 minutes, I'll start the veggies to get that boiling. And by the time it heats up, be ready for the veggies. Now, let's season that flounder. We got some juice, we gotta get the juice out. Now, get that flounder out. Oh yeah, beautiful. All right, I'm gonna give it just a, a light dabbing to get it dry. That's good enough. Well, I heard the water starting to get hot over here for the rice, so we're gonna stir it up, get everything blended really well going to reduce the heat and cover. All right, now I'm going to turn down that flame to the low. Get back to the fish. Now I'm going to add just a little bit of olive oil to spread all over the fish to make our seasoning stick. Mm. 
Nice. All right, this is what I'm gonna use. Just some lemon and pepper mixed together. Then I have some garlic, garlic powder. And I have a little bit of my breading here. Not heavy, just a little bit of that breading. Now it's time to get our veggies boiling. All right, we got that cooking. Get that heated up. Might as well stir this guy a little bit. Oh yeah, it's bubbling good. You wanna see? Bubbling good. Now I'm gonna line my baking sheet because I didn't mention, but we're gonna bake the fish. Yeah, doesn't that look great? All right, the veggie water's boiling. So let's pour in the veggies. Yeah. And then my always customized secret bonus add handful of some peppers and onions. And don't forget the garlic. Well, I didn't cut up any garlic, but we got this powder. And I got a special addition after they're done. As soon as these veggies start boiling, we're gonna start cooking the fish. While that stuff is cooking, you know what's up next? That's right, a channel shout out. Let's go do a channel shout out right now. And who do we have here? We're gonna shout out Yogi Hollow Farm. That's right, my new friends, Lisa at Yogi Hollow Farm. Let's see what they're up to. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna to be cooking something, so watch out, because you know what that means when Lisa's cooking, so. <laughs> Today we are making egg muffins. So I've got a whisk, a large bowl, I've got some bacon bits, Italian seasoning, crushed red pepper, sea salt. So again, I'm just gonna mix this up because I wanted to make the whole batch. Yeah, Lisa's cooking it up over there at Yogi Halal Farms. Go check out Lisa's channel. Tell her that Robert sent you from RV Weekends and I'm sure she'll be happy that you came by. Thanks for checking her out. All right, what else comes up next? That's right, a t-shirt. Let me show you my t-shirt. I'm gonna lower the camera lens. I'm gonna show you my favorite t-shirt. My favorite t-shirt from Disney. It's the Twilight Zone tower of terror this is my favorite shirt for disney i love it because the characters are up here and they're nice and like happy to get on the ride and then boom they drop down in the hollywood tower of terror and look at them look at them faces oh they're scared out of their wits that's right that's my favorite ride at disney is the tower of terror i just love it so i thought I got to find this shirt. I saw the shirt. Somebody else was wearing it when I was in the park. So I'm like, I got to get that shirt. So I'm glad I did. So I love to do shout outs and t-shirts. And so that's the t-shirt for this time. All right, let's get back to cooking. You remember the pineapples, right? You're going with the pineapple slices right now. Into the pot. And the rice is almost done. Well, my veggies aren't even boiling yet. Oh, yeah, they are. All right, cool. So now we gotta, we're gonna stir in the pineapple. The veggies are boiling. Now what's next? Move right over here. All right, let's get this toaster oven going. We're gonna bake at 425. Let's go to 425. And we're only gonna do it for six minutes. That'll be plenty. So now we're preheating. All right, 
Dinner's almost done, but it's not done yet, and I'm hungry, and I think I'll snack on something. What is this? It's homemade beef jerky. You want to see? Homemade beef jerky. Yeah. Yeah, so good. Let me get a smaller piece. I don't want to pick out on you guys. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yes. Yummy. I've had several requests to make a video on how I make my beef jerky. So I'm going to do that. Coming up later. Time to add the food. Won't be long now. Okay, we're at three and a half minutes till the fish is done. Time to turn off everything. All right, we're gonna drain the veggies and add a little bit more flavoring. Let's do it. All right, here we go. Drain the water out. Oh, look at that water's hiding in there. All right. Now, I'm gonna add a little special flavoring. For all, those of you that are new to the channel, this is what I like to, to do some uh, veggie garlic butter with Parmesan cheese and basil, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. And we get in, get that all hot and melty. Let it sit there and melt a little and then stir it all in. The fish is done. Yeah, buddy, let's do this. Oh yeah. Look at that. Mm. Yeah, look at that. Oh, let's get the other parts in here. All right, you stir that, stir that butter in there. All right, now we gotta add this to our meal. Let's do it. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. You know what's next, right? Get it in my mouth as soon as possible. Oh, yeah. That flounder is light and delicate with some garlic, lemon and pepper, a little bit of breadcrumbs gonna be amazing all right guys that's gonna do it for my cooking video of my flounder oh man it's so good thank you for watching and i hope you enjoyed the video and if you did please hit the thumbs up and if you want to see more content like this on a regular basis subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell select all and you'll receive a notice every time i upload my newest video i also travel around the state of florida uh, i forgot one thing Oh, yeah. Moose tracks. That's what I'm talking about right there. Oh, and you know what I add to this? Mm, mm, mm. Caramel. Oh, what else could I add to this? Mm-hmm. Whipped cream. That about does it. Oh. What about this? Yeah, some cherries. It's going to be a good dessert. Check you guys later. All right, well, all that starts. While all that is getting cooked, we know what we do. You know what we do. The regulars, while while that, while while that. I've had several requests to make my beef jerky. Make a video on my making how I make my beef jerky. Check you guys later.